was established shortly after um, the revolution, initially under the editorship of uh, one of Iran's major uh, literary historians, um, professor at Mashhad University, uh, Dr. Jalal Matini, and then uh, through a number of um, editorial changes, um, for a while, uh, Mr. Sharof Meskoup was the editor of, of it. Um, and uh, in the past um, decade or so, um, Hormoz Hekmat has been um, the uh, chief editor of Iran Nomi. It has always occupied a very important position um, in the scholarly um, publications outside of Iran. Uh, first and more foremost, because it is a journal that has been published in Persian, um, and there are very few uh, journals uh, of its caliber um, that uh, have come out in Persian and have had uh, this continuity of um, publication. Um, it has also had um, very high standards, editorial standards. Um, I have personally been associated with um, several of the um, issues of the journal, which I helped um, co-edit um, with the editor of the journal. Um, it has had uh, a circulation inside of Iran as well, even though perhaps legally it has not been able, it has not been easy to uh, to get uh, the journal into the hands of um, subscribers in Iran. Uh, but in various ways, it has found its way um, into the Iranian uh, leadership, um, and I am quite certain uh, that. Uh, for many of them, this has been um, an important uh, journal. I've lived in Iran after the Islamic Revolution for 18 years. And as a teacher and a writer, I can still feel the sense of excitement I had um, every time I obtained um, a new issue of Iran Nome. Uh, just look at the amazing array of its editors, uh, from Jalal Matini to Dariush Shayegan, Dariush Ashuri, uh, the amazing Hormuz Hekmat, and now um, its new um, intellectually vigorous and amazing Mohammad uh, Tabakul Targhi. They come from very different backgrounds and uh, um, socially, politically, culturally, their ideas are very different. But one thing they have in common is passion for knowledge and passion for Iran. And that is what makes Iran Nome uh, so important. I have um, published uh, articles with the uh, journal and um, I can testify that uh, it goes through the um, normal pre academic uh, procedures of, of uh, uh, reviewing and edit uh, editing uh, the materials and the result uh, has always been uh, very interesting, compelling and beneficial uh, research uh, papers. I think it's a very important journal because it's one of the few uh, very substantive uh, journals in Persian language that is uh, devoted to scholarly discussion of issues pertaining to Iran and uh, in that sense it's uh, quite unique uh, it does not uh, uh, discriminate uh, on a political basis uh, so in that sense uh, it is uh, important to have a, uh, a scholarly uh, journal that is in Persian language and is accessible to uh, anybody who can read Persian all over the world and the fact the fact that this is now on the internet is very helpful for uh, those people in Persian speaking world and Iran in particular uh, many articles are directly written in, in Persian others uh, are translated from English by very competent uh, translators I have had that experience myself about three or four articles of mine have come out and I've always had complete control over the final uh, version um, I think the editors have done a tremendous job in providing um, this uh, space for scholars of Iran to write in Persian at a time when uh, censorship in Iran does not allow for um, everything that one wants to say to be said uh, in the public sphere. Well, I think it's an exceptional phenomenon when you are in, in, in the West and in the West you can establish a journal that can bridge 
the East and the West. And Ironami is trying to do that. It has been doing that for many, many years. And it has been doing it successfully. And uh, under the directorship of Professor Mamad Tavakoli Targi, it's going to be even, I think, um, much more successful because I think it's going to not only bridge East and West, but I, I think it's going to bridge uh, modern and pre-modern in Iranian history. Iran Name is uh, a very, very important journal, has been since the revolution in Iran because of the problems with restrictions on publishing anything scholarly. I think this was a opening for many scholars to be able to publish in Persian and it has been a rather it's become a center by itself for exchange of ideas uh, among scholars who write in Persia uh, whether it was when the editor was initially Dr. Jalal Matini later uh, Dr. Hekmat and now uh, uh, Dr. Tarak Kuli. Uh, and it's going to be an important journal for many years to come. It's already recognized by all universities as a major journal.